Hi guys and welcome to a bonus feature that will be included as part of the play and learn video. If you haven't seen it you can check out my channel right here along with the my videos library. So for today's bonus feature we're going to look at a compilation of toys that McDonald's did with Fox Kids Europe. Nowadays it's turned into Disney XD and surprisingly and unfortunately I do not have Disney XD on one of the TV boxes but I'm sure that I did watch a lot of Disney back in my day so as you can see we got Power Rangers Ninja Storm which is a Power Rangers was an American adaptation of the Japanese Super Sentai series it was developed by the Toei Company Limited who also did the Digimon franchise. Both Power Rangers and Digimon are by the same company, Sam Saban Brands. And needless to say, it was Saban Entertainment beforehand, back in the late 80s. And it was folded into the Walt Disney Company and was brought back, but later was brought back to life under the Saban Brands name in 2012. And also on our list that we're going to be doing is Totally Spies, which is a French series that parodies the spy genre, mainly the 60s series Charlie's Angels, where you have Alex, Clover and Sam working together as spies whilst trying to survive in Beverly Hills High School. And later on in the fifth season, onwards they moved from Beverly Hills to Malibu University so that is a big step up considering that they are adults now originally I was going to include Medabots and Gadget and the Gadgetinis but unfortunately that didn't came with a pack neither did those other two DVDs that they have there so basically McDonald's and Fox Kids Europe just came out with a, with a bunch of toys here that were themed. They were actually spinners in my opinion and you have to spin those around whilst they have produced those CD cyclones in each week. It they they were bought out in February 2004 and and it was lasted about four weeks. Of course, four weeks here in February, they have to come out with each and every toy that they came out with. Power Rangers was the first, I think. Then later came Metabots. Totally Spies was next in the third one. And finally we have Gadget and the Gadgetinis. In French it's Gadget et the Gadgetinis. I don't watch French series but I think that's what it's called. So to start off with I'm going to look at the games and see how it fares. With every CD-ROM included in the promotion pack, you also get these extras including those screen savers that they got, as well as a bunch of fun and games that they've got. As you can see on the cover we have a Red Ranger, which is the Ninja Storm version. And that came out, and being that it's strange that in 2004, I believe that Power Rangers Ninja Storm just ended and they made way for Dino Thunder later on in that same year. So what I'm going to do is put so what I'm going to do is take the disc out put this up in the hard drive. So I'm going to put this CD-ROM in the hard drive itself. Put it in the DVD slot. And we'll see how it fares with this game. Hopefully it'll still work on my computer. But if it doesn't work, I'll have to just forget about it and move on to the next game. 
as you can see, we have the Fox Kids icon right there. Let me turn the volume on. Now, like I said, 2004 was when Power Rangers Ninja Storm got killed off and was replaced with Dino Thunder in that, later that same year. So you got your basic features and they include the games as well. You can download these wallpapers. There's also a screensaver and finally there is the music section. Alright, so here is the music section. It basically consists of four Jetsuit shows that was aired in that same time. There's Totally Spies, the one we're listening to, which is Moon Baby's version of Here We Go, which is actually the theme tune to this one. Of course, there is, pa and also there is the Power Rangers Ninja Storm theme, the theme to Gadget and the Gadgetinis, and finally there's Metabots. And also we got the wallpapers. The wallpapers here are in two. The wallpapers here are in HD, I believe, and they all consist of three ranges in total. And you can download them. Created with the registration version extract. Unfortunately, I can't even extract that because I am not a Power Rangers fan, so. Yes, I want to exit. There's also four papers of the Red Ranger, the Yellow Ranger, and the Blue Ranger. The Blue Ranger is actually a female, not a male one. The same thing goes for Mystic Force, but I'm not even going to spoil this one. And finally, there is the screen save section. Now, on my computer, in fact... There is no screensaver, but back in the days I used to have a screensaver. But unfortunately, due to my computer getting upgraded, I don't even have a screensaver. All that happens if I don't use the computer long enough, it will just go blank and go to sleep. Now it's time to look at the games itself. The games itself, so it basic, so it happens to give you the instructions by using the arrow keys. It's sort of like a platforming game, and what you have to do here is that you have to move the Red Ranger around into some sort of platforming stage. Up makes you jump. They consist of 10 levels each for this game. The same format will later go on in Totally Spies, Metabots, Gadget and the Gadgetinis. Those are the other three games that are included in the promotion pack. But like I said before, I don't have these other two DVDs, CD-ROMs. So you just have to bear with me. Now, for each level, it gets really harder. For example, in level 3, you've got your fire there. And if you do manage to take damage in one of them, you lose a life. However, you can gain power-ups. Like, for example, you've got your extra life here, which you can be able to gain back a life if you manage to step on it. So you've just got an extra life. And I just got hit by fire. So that's just how the game works. It's just a simple platforming, side-scrolling game. 
but with a few like different levels that you have to go through in one sitting. <coughs> Sorry if my fingers get through the camera, but that's just how the game plays. Now on level five, it gets really hard and you have your blue fire attack. And uh, yeah, that gave me game over. So that's how the game will fares for this point. Now we're just going to have to exit out and move on to that of Totally Spies. As I mentioned before, it is a French TV series, but personally, I am good at French languages. But I never watched the French cartoons, not even a bit. So to at least Spies is up next on this DVD ROM. Keep in mind that I own totally the Totally Spy CD-ROM back when I was a little girl. So you got your basic wallpapers, screensavers, and music. Right, so there's Alex, Clover, and Sam, and he's those are the three girls. So I think that gets the wallpaper. There's a green saver for them. And finally we get onto the game itself. Now we're totally spies. It's basically the same game but with Clover in it. But only this time you have to get the flowers instead of the lightning bolts. And you have some different projectiles that are getting in your way. Keep in mind that those are the same flowers using the Totally Spice logo, just to be sure. They're replaced with robots this time. And they have the exact same 10 levels. Yeah, you get the point. It's just a simple platforming game, but this time you have some different characters there. I also have... I also do not have the... I do not have the uh, Metabots... CD-ROM or the Gadget and Gadgetini's the CD-ROM but if any of you guys don't want it and so if any of you guys don't want that those other two CD-ROMs which are Metabots or Gadget and Gadgetini's then you would be able to get it up and send it to me as always you can have if you enjoyed this if you enjoyed this video please leave a like if you want some more of them comment on your opinions on what you think and make sure you hit that subscribe button and also you can hit the little bell when you receive notifications of my channel of what's to come so thank you all for watching and as always i will see you next time